It's been amazing. I, I feel like, you know, we, you never know what the chemistry would, between people who are working together is going to happen, but I mean, film is this incredible collaboration and it's been so nice to work with both of these women who I'm so inspired by. Um, Laura, I've known her work for so long and we've sort of satellited each other for years. Um, and, you know, to have this love story that was written by Cheryl about her and her mother, we just feel so privileged to have that opportunity. It's a huge gift. It's been amazing for me when I was living the experience, taking that hike on the Pacific Crest Trail in 1995. It never occurred to me uh, that it would e even become a book, let alone um, a film. And I've had, you know, such, it's been such an honor for me to work with such talented people and watching this, um, ex ex this whole film experience. Reese gives such a beautiful performance in the film. I, every time I see it, I'm just, I see something new. And of course, the dynamic between Laura Dern and Reese on screen is so moving, so true to the kind of deep, rich relationship I had with my mother. So I just feel honored that, it, that the film was made. I feel thrilled they invited me on their journey. And, um, you know, I've gotten to speak about how extraordinary it is just to know Cheryl um, and have the privilege of honoring her love of her mother, the memory of her mother, having her mother as now a muse in all our lives and as this maternal figure in all our lives. Um, but also, in addition to talking about Reese as an actor, who's so incredible and so fearless in the movie, I want to continue to thank her as a producer, not only to make opportunities for human stories to be told and an opportunity for me to get to play Bobby, but to be so protective of Cheryl, which was so incredible and really set the tone for all of us to be, you know, uh, very, very um, diligent in trying to care for your story and honor your mom. And, and it really was in incredible how you did that. I've learned so much from the book. I mean, <laughs> just things that I had thoughts and ideas about but were so beautifully articulated by Cheryl in the book. Um, thoughts about fear, that it's born of a story that we tell ourselves. Or, you know, I was saying one of my favorite parts of the book yesterday was that after she throws the boot off the side of the mountain, she's looked around to see if anyone was laughing and she realized no one was. And then she said, I realize the universe is never, ever kidding. It takes, what does it say? It's, That's right. It takes what it wants? It takes what it wants and it never gives it back. And I think that the glory, you know, the, the, the pain of that is, is balanced by the glory of the truth that the universe also graces us all the time. It gives us what we don't deserve. And I certainly felt um, on my hike that um, I went on the hike feeling so acutely the, the sorrow at what the universe had taken away. And what it gave me was the magnificence and wonder of that wild beauty that was mine for the taking. All my life, my mother had told me, you have the opportunity to have beauty in your life every day. It's up to you to take it. And you know that ended up being um, the, 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 apps, the tool I reached for when I needed to save myself. You know, I put myself in the way of beauty by getting myself out there on the Pacific Crest Trail. And so, you know, what I learned in watching the film is that that keeps on happening. You know, I, I, I did my best possible work in Wild. I wrote that book not knowing how the world would greet it, if the world would greet it. And what I got, because I kept faith with that, was all of this. And so all, all throughout the making of the movie, every day I just, I said thank you.